Hello and welcome to our countdown to the top 10 Jennifer Garner movies. Jennifer Garner has been a Hollywood mainstay for over two decades now, with a filmography that includes a range of genres and roles. So without further ado, let's dive into our list. Coming in at number 10 is Valentine's Day. In this star-studded romantic comedy, Garner plays Julius Fitzpatrick, a teacher who is proposed by her boyfriend on Valentine's Day. While the film received mixed reviews, it was a box of his success and featured an assembled cast that included Jessica Alba, Bradley Cooper and Julia Roberts. Hi. Sorry. Yeah. What are you doing with the flowers? All the ones that nobody wants. So you're giving them a second life? Yeah, most shops throw them away. Number 9 on our list is Danny Collins. This film sees Garner star alongside Al Pacino, who plays an aging rock star who discovers a letter from John Lennon that was written to him years ago. Garner plays Pacino's daughter Nina, who is skeptical of his attempts to make amends for past mistakes. Critics praised Pacino's performance. But Garner also shines in our supporting role. My parents are dead. His mom is too. I mean, I would love for our children to know their their one remaining grandparent. I, I would love for my husband to to know his father. In a few minutes, my husband's going to walk through that door, and when he does, I, I feel pretty confident this will be the last time I ever see you. And despite your celebrity, and despite what I want for my own family, at number eight is the kingdom. This action thriller sees Garner play an FBI agent who is a part of a team sent to investigate a bombing at an American housing compound in Saudi Arabia. The film also stars Jamie Foxx, Chris Cooper and Jason Bateman and received a generally positive reviews for its intense action sequences and political commentary. Coming in at number 7 is Juno. Garner has a supporting role in this India darling, which tells the story of a teenage girl who becomes pregnant and decides to give the baby up for adoption. Garner plays Vanessa, the prospective adoptive mother who struggles with her own infertility issues. Juno received a widespread critical acclaim and went on to earn four Academy Awards nominations. Number 6 on our list is Lab Simon. In this coming-of-age film, Garner plays Emily Spire, mother of Simon, a high school student who is struggling to come out as gay to his friends and family. The film was praised for its heartfelt message and Garner's performance as a supportive and loving mother. You actually, um, I did want to talk to you guys about something. What is it? Uh, well, let me guess. <laughs> you got somebody pregnant. No, you're pregnant. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I knew it. Yeah, I'm pregnant. I knew it. And he's got that glow about him, babe. At number five is Daredevil. Garner plays Electra Nachios, a martial artist and love interest to the titular hero. The film received mixed reviews, but Garner's performance as fierce and independent Electra was widely praised. Now. Tell me. You want the truth? Absolutely. She's hideous. Coming in at number 4 is 13 going on 30. In this romantic comedy, Garner plays Gina Ring, a 13 year old girl wakes up as her 30-year-old self overnight. The film was a box office success and is now considered a cult classic, thanks in part to Garner's charming and relatable performance. Number 3 on our list is Dallas Buyers Club. Garner plays Dr. Eve Sachs, a physician who helps AIDS patients in the 90s 80s. The film stars Matthew McConaughey and Jared Leto, both of whom own Academy Awards for their performance. 
Gunner's performance as the compassionate and dedicated doctor was also widely praised. At number 2 is Alias. While technically not a movie, the spy thriller series helped launch Garner's career and still considered one of her most iconic roles. Garner plays Sidney Bisto, a double agent working for CIA who must navigate a complex web of espionage and personal relationships. This show was praised for its intricate plot and Garner's captivating performance. And finally, at the top of our list is in this drama, Garner plays titular character, a single mother, and there you have it, our top 10 Jennifer Garner movies. With a career spinning over 20 years, Garner has proven herself to be a versatile and talented actress, and we can't wait to see what she has in store for us next. Thanks for turning in.